is Black History Month, and there's a special art exhibition now open at the end is West Hollywood. It's called Black in Every Color, and it highlights 15 artists who work across a range of mediums. Some of those talented artists are here today to share more about their work. Josiah David Jones is actually the curator of the show, and Vaccine is one of the artists in the exhibit. Some of your art behind us this morning. I know it's zoomed in, but it still looks gorgeous. Thank, Thank you guys you. for being with us this morning. Thank you. Josiah, I want to start with you. Tell me more about the exhibit and what it's all about. Yeah, absolutely. Um, we really just wanted to create a show that uh, highlighted black creativity, um, especially going over uh, like Black History Month and everything. We wanted something that expressed what artists like Vaccine and, and Brittany S. Price, who's back here, um, what they provide to you know the world and how black creativity uh, impacts culture all around us. So. Uh, we work with the Andas, and when they said that we could use a space, uh, we really just wanted to create access for more artists to be represented in the fine art space. Yeah, that's really wonderful. You guys had the opening last night. How did that go? It was phenomenal, honestly. I think we had almost 700 people come out. Um, people had a lot of fun, looked at a lot of different artwork. Uh, we even had like a second tier of artwork come in as well. Um, so it was a great turnout. All right, awesome. And so Vaccine, some of your work is in there. It's really beautiful. You were showing me one of your pieces earlier. I was like, what is that made out of? You're actually, it's just a painting, right? Yes, yeah, so everything's painted to look like a collage. Awesome. Tell me more about your work and how, what it's inspired by. Um, I mean, you know, at the basic foundation, porches have always celebrated power. Mm -hmm. So I, you know, for me personally, I think women are God's greatest creation. So Say it again, I, Vaccine. I, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not going to argue with you this morning. I, I, I'll take now listen, that, that, I think you're necklace is rubbing on the microphone so your outfit's great i'm gonna fix this on tv so they can hear you better okay there you go <laughs> yeah I appreciate it yeah um yeah so i i choose to celebrate women and um like i said i think women are god's greatest creation so um i celebrate women in my art we have one of your pieces up now tell me about this one specifically um, that piece was gold lives inside you and it's from my vanity pop collection I'm, I'm really known for two different distinct bodies of work my vanity pop collection that celebrates women mm -hmm. and then i do a body of work legends only that celebrates black excellence wow um and it's just about an elevation of of our culture you know it's about an, uh, uh, exposing people to who we are what we do the greatness that comes from the black experience mm -hmm. and at the end of the day connecting us all because Definitely. we're all so similar you know regardless of the small differences we're all very similar and it's about connecting people through art yeah that's beautiful black in every color is also about those diversity in experiences how they're the same how they're different how though it all is still the black experience right absolutely absolutely yeah. I completely agree <laughs> what do you feel like people will get out of the show um truly i just want people to kind of connect and be able to experience all, like a variety of different work and mm -hmm. that's why we put the what the work that's there um i just want people to go there and, and you know be able to experience these artists because uh, they are artists that all should be represented in major galleries but you know representation isn't always there so mm. that's what we're doing with uh, creating the platforms working with places like the Andas to create access to that kind of art so people can experience it in every way yeah that access is so important and a lot of people don't realize that that is still a battle that you have phenomenal artists and you really don't see their work especially artists of color in other places unless there is a show like this vaccine have you experienced that I've, I've been a professional artist for 12 years and it's been a consistent uphill climb. Mm. Um, I tend to be one of only, if not the only black in most shows that I'm in. So it's very much like that, hmm. um, which keeps me going that much harder because I know I'm opening doors for artists that are coming up behind me. Um, but we're, we're, there's, there's a lot to still be changed, but I mean, you do have the NFT space. You do have a lot of things exciting that are happening in the art world. So mm -hmm. it's coming slowly but surely. Yeah. All right, really great. Well, you've created a phenomenal space to show off some phenomenal artists. Thank you guys for joining us this morning to tell us about it. And you can find this segment on our website, kkel9.com slash seen on TV. We'll be right back after the break. Go check out the show.